Today's going to be a great day, despite the fact that uh, there's, I'm not really looking forward to it. But one thing I'm going to do differently today than I've done the last few Fridays is that I'm going to go into it doing things a little bit differently. Make sure to subscribe to hit the notification bell. Check out the links below. I have some of the books that have helped me live a better and more satisfying life. And I hope these books can help you too. Fridays are, let's say, hard on me physically. Both of my jobs, I end up in positions that are more physically demanding of me than any other day of the week. Not only that, but it's a 16-hour workday. And I know by the end of the day, at my second job, I'm going to be exhausted. So this morning, I decided to think about it and say, what are some things that I could do differently that are going to help me make it through this day a little bit better? Well, first of all, I got to sleep about half an hour earlier last night than what I usually do. Second of all, I've thought about what are some of the things that during the middle of my Fridays, I wish I would have done in the morning that I can do right now that are going to get me to where I need to be physically to be in a better position. The first thing is that I know that I have to eat healthier. So I'm going to have a really good healthy breakfast, some whole grain, yogurt, some eggs, no stopping at McDonald's this morning for sure. The second thing I'm going to do is I'm going to stretch. Yeah, I'm going to do a bunch of stretches. I'm going to get myself in position so that, I, you know what, I'm not going to be as physically hurting uh, by the end of the day and I'll feel a lot better. But it's the fact that instead of worrying about how too much today is going to suck, I'm going to do something about it. And psychologically, what that's going to do is I'm going to expect different outcomes out of my body. And I'm going to see how this works out. I think it's going to work out very well. I'll let you kind of give you an update on tomorrow, but I'm already feeling more positive about it. Yesterday, uh, during probably around 5 p.m. yesterday, I was thinking about today and I was dreading it. I'm going into it right now and I'm feeling pretty darn good about it. Not only that, but I'm going into it with the thought of, okay, so this is my long day. This is also the day of the week that I make the most money. And that is another positive, positive way of looking at it. So my lesson for today is if you have a day that you're dreading, what are some of the things you could do to set yourself up better for success? And what are some of the positive ways you can look at that day, whether it's saying, okay, so this is a tough day, but this is a day that's going to build me and make me a stronger person. Uh, is it that uh, you can look at it positively by saying, hey, once I get done with today, the rest of my week or the next week is going to be easy. There's ways that you can look at it more positively instead of kind of being in this negative zone when you start your day because that, if you start off negatively, the anxiety is going to get to you and it is going to be a bad day. But anyways, my name is James. I'm going to have a great day. You have a great day. May the force be with you. Peace out.